So, now that we've reached the end of this video, I hope that myself and Dave have given you an insight into our shoot and form techniques which help to make us great shooters. More than insight, actually, the way I look at it. Some of the stuff we've shared might actually get us banned or thrown out of some of the professional organizations that we join. Our peers aren't going to be too happy with completely spilling the beans and blowing the lid off this stuff. But it's got to be done. Because ultimately, I feel in this game anymore, there are no secrets. We can teach you everything you need to know. Heck, we could even set your bow up identical to ours. But in the end, when you stand on the line, you've got to be the one that executes the steps and follows through. The aim of this video is not simply to act as a one-time thing. What we've hopefully created for you here is a reference guide, something which you can refer back to on a day-to-day -day basis in order to check that you're following our methods and you're doing it right. Consider it almost another tool in your arsenal, just like a set of Allen wrenches, a bow square, another sight, spare stabilizer, anything. Knowledge is a tool, and that's the most important thing in learning to excel and push yourself to levels that you truly desire to reach. So if there's a particular flaw or problem in your technique, it might be worthwhile for you to just revisit that one particular chapter and just refresh yourself on what mine and Dave's ideas were. And hopefully this will be a good guide in the right direction for you. On behalf of Liam, myself, and the entire Bowstring Media team, I'd like to thank you for taking the time to enjoy this video. And we hope you've enjoyed watching it just as much as we've enjoyed making it. Hello. Welcome to the White Film Studio. We're going to talk absolute for the purpose of this DVD today. So, who better to talk about than my friend Dave Cousins here? Pretty much the king of all. <laughs> Most definitely. No, like, because watch it'll raise the whole. <laughs> it's nice. Where's my snare? I'm not in the mood now. <laughs> No, I will not perform like a trained monkey. <laughs> or I can bring the shoulder up, which totally <laughs> this whole chapter, because you should be explaining this, Yeah, not me. I did think that. <laughs> okay, so moving on to our next chapter in this video production, uh, we're gonna- Sorry, you need to look at that camera? Oh, <laughs> sorry, come on. Uh, real, uh, <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so hopefully we've, you know, um... <laughs> I don't know about you guys, I'm tired of talking and you're probably here tired of, tired, tired of sounding like I don't know about you guys, you're probably tired of hearing me talk, just as tired I don't know if you guys... <laughs> what? In summary now to what we've discussed, it's important to remember that your shot routine... <laughs> In summary to this... It's... I'm gonna hold my hand to this. <laughs> nah. <laughs> the grip. So ultimately, it's really important to remember that your pre-shot routine is your shot routine.
thrown in with the twisters now. 